Today we're going to show you how to fill up a, this is a Honda Civic, but it applies to any CNG natural gas car. But when you go to purchase your fuel, you'll always have to start out with entering your credit card and then enter all the information. And they only have one card reader for the all of the different pumps. Uh, once you get that all ready to go, uh, then you go ahead and, and put the nozzle on and start filling up. First of all, you need to see how much pressure your car can take. On here you can see that it's 3,600. And so when you go to fill up you at the tank, at the pump you'll see uh, a 3,600 or it may say 3,000. And uh, you want to go with a higher number if you can, but you got to check and make sure which uh, PSI your, your vehicle can handle. For example, this pump is only at 3,000 PSI, so you know some cars you can't go up to 3,600. You have to use the lower 3,000. Now, if your car says that it can handle the 3,600, you can use the 3,000. It just won't fill up your tank as much. So to get the maximum benefit, if you can, if yours will hold the 3,600, you want to use that. Now this is one way, um, what you do is you turn the lever, you got to pull the cap off, put, put it on, and then turn the lever so you can fit it on. You can see how it went in. Then you're going to pull the lever up and then go one more time. That means it's all ready to go. And then once you've attached the nozzle, you just go ahead and pull this down and it will start filling up your tank. Now to take this off, you just go ahead and pull the lever again and it'll pop off and just pull it out. And uh, of course you want to lift this lever up. You know, this is a different nozzle. You just lift up and pull it out. And that's what it looks like. I'll show you how to use this one. You know, again, you got to take the cap off. Push it in as far as you can and then you just pull the trigger. And you can, you'll hear it click. That means it's connected. And you just pull the lever down and it will go ahead and start. Now to release it, you just pull up on this lever here and then you'll feel, feel the pressure or hear the pressure release. Now this is the third type of nozzle. This is what it looks like. Again, you'll push this on like you did before. You'll hear it click and then you just turn this on and you just pull the lever down and it will go ahead and start. When you finish, you turn it off, pull back on this and it will release it. And then you go ahead and push the lever up when you're all finished. Thanks for watching Big Al Repairs and hopefully you subscribe.